Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Welcome to Morals in Minutes. I am Muhammad Ali and today we will talk about the danger of pride. We face a problem which affects a lot of us today. You always hear the words, I can't do this job, I'm much better than this, or look at me, look at my status. This is common around the world and it is pride. Pride ranges from pride in worship, on self, actions, etc. Pride is considered amongst the greatest sins as we read in the Holy Quran and Sunnah. Islam was revealed to remove pride from the heart, since Arabs were known to carry pride and arrogance. Henceforth, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala stated in the Holy Quran in several verses, such as in Al-Nahl, indeed, He does not love the proud. In another verse, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala states, and whatever creature in the heaven and the earth makes an obeisance to Allah and the angels, and they do not show pride. From this verse, we can picture an image that from all Allah's creations that worship Him, they do not do it proudly. For pride and superiority is for Allah only. These two verses from the Holy Quran are but an example to show the dear viewer of the danger of pride. To conclude, I will narrate to you from the talking Quran, the Ahlul Bayt peace be upon them. It has been narrated by Shaykh Al Kulaini in a reliable tradition on the authority of Hukam, who asked Imam Sadiq, peace be upon him, what is the lowest degree of apostasy? Imam, peace be upon him, said, Verily, Kibar, pride is the lowest degree. In another narration narrated by Imam Baqar, peace be upon him, he said, Honor is God's robe, and pride is his mantle, and whomever wants to require it will be thrown into hell by God Almighty. Henceforth, we can see that pride leads to one's destruction. To save oneself from this, we must engage ourselves in prayer and supplication to God, who by God's will, it will be removed from our homes. We ask Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala to save us from pride, so we may not fall on the same path of Satan when he said, You made me of fire and Adam of clay. I am better. May Allah rid us all of the sin of pride and may we be amongst Muhammad and his holy progeny. Wassalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh.